Hello and welcome back to XCOM Chimera Squad. My name is Saiken. We're playing Impossible Iron Man Hardcore. Hardest difficulty is single save and you cannot fail a single mission. We are done with the first faction. The progeny crumbled at our knees and begged for forgiveness before we psi bombed her. And it's now time to start with the second faction, the Grey Phoenix, a looter faction of scavengers. And uh, we are starting with our investigation. Unfortunately, don't have enough intel to upgrade this here, so we're only going to get 40 credits out of it. We can use a lot of money, to be honest. Hostile forces feel overwhelmed. They may attempt to cut their losses in a spectacular fashion. But they might destroy evidence or activate a bomb as you approach. Whatever the case, stop them. Good, we're stopping them. Don't worry. We got better armor now. Uh, meaning also we got more utility items and you can see that the way that I play the game I really do not invest a lot in utility items for now we have we have an incredibly potent economy because we upgraded the entirety of all of the field operators and continue to do that we have invested a lot in training so all of that worked well what we haven't done uh, so far is invested a lot into the equipment um, usually you can get a lot of equipment as mission rewards and I'm kind of banking on that and the characters are even good without equipment as you can see. Uh, we're going into a three uh, encounter mission so let's get this bad boy rolling. An anonymous tip said Great Phoenix planned to raid the city archives. Looks like they were right. You got there in time but 3-1 PD is still en route. You'll need to stop Great Phoenix without backup. Sounds bleak. But on the plus side, today's med spray is minty fresh. I can confirm this. <laughs> Please tell me you didn't have the med spray. Not intentionally. The worst part here is that I believe you. <laughs> Some of the dialogues are actually really funny. Okay, a uh, few aggressive enemies. Uh, last unit is guaranteed to land their shot and shots will crit. Hell yeah, why would you ever take the security door? It should be the other way around. And since there is no aggressive enemy, we might start to do it this way around and really put um, put cheer up on the back. It's go time. Hello there, guys. A legionnaire, an adder. An adder is a viper, so. Um, we are now fighting against mutants and uh, vipers, which is great. I uh, gotta bring med kits because they make you immune against the adder's poison. And you, want, you don't want to deal with the adder's poison. It sucks. Legionnaire takes a lot of damage. You know what? Let's just kill him. Good. That's one down. Might as well take the adder. Nice little crit. And 100% hit guarantee. There we go. Alright. So, I guess what we could do is, hmm, <clears throat> we could try to mind control the Viper here. And then go for this Legionnaire. Yeah, I think that's a good idea. <clears throat> Birch takes uh, an extra action. And completely stuns the Viper. Good job. Yeah, he's still hunkered down. I don't like that because hunkered down means we have a bigger 
even a bigger problem hitting him. So might as well push him further down. Just denying their actions at the moment. Now what we can do with these hunkered down uh, legionnaires of course is taking them out as well. There you go, so much for being hunkered down, buddy. Yeah, and I think that's a good one. I like it. Pushing down the other legion, uh, legionnaire. And let's hit the Viper. With a good old soul fire. There we go. They haven't even taken a single turn yet. You know what? Shelter can take the kinetic shield. That's fine. And this here might be a crit. Oh, no, but a good hit. I like it. I don't want to stand near the others so that we're not getting poisoned. The other definitely will spit poison. This guy here still hasn't acted yet. On the other hand, I like the idea of critting him. It's really no good position to crit him and not be affected by the poison of the Viper other than outside of the building, which ironically enough we can't take. Because that would that would be unfair, right? Yeah, I'm just going to stand here. Uh, it's a very effective position, although we haven't been critting the him. That is very unfortunate. Alright, that's a hit into Kinetic Shield. By the way, half cover, thanks to his shield. Forcing him to go berserk. All right, shoot one of your friends. Take a, uh, take a uh, selection. And now, since we got all three of them in our mind network, Bam. Nine points of damage. Two of them immediately taken out. And we haven't even taken any damage. That's what I'm talking about. The yeah, they haven't really had many actions. We completely dominated them. I'm seeing a coded signal coming out of the archives. Does Great Phoenix have some kind of transmitter? How big are we talking? With this signal strength, I'd guess something person-sized. Likely plugged into the local power grid. Nothing in this room, but we'll keep looking. Alright, this time the secure entrance seems to make sense, because we don't want our weapon to be disabled. So let's try how oh, this is going to work out. Hello there. Surprise, surprise. Got an adder, got another adder, got yet another adder, got an adder. 
a legionnaire, a legionnaire, and a legionnaire. Well, hello there. That's one hit. And down. And you know, when we're hitting everyone and dazing them, that should disable their poison, unless it's on the bite, of course. In which case, it of course won't be disabled. Good, well, we got a lot of enemies over here. <clears throat> And we certainly can't kill all of them. Oh, but that's really good. I like it. Flash banging three. Could move all the way over here. And try to take down this adder here. Problem is the adder will definitely take a turn. So it almost might be better to take down one of the later adders. Like this one here. That way we're actually denying a turn. <clears throat> Alright, he's disoriented and half cover. Okay. Well, that's a pretty decent hit for being disoriented. Let's take out that le legionnaire. Unfortunately, only a stun for one. Disabling the adder. I like the armor around the tail. <laughs> kind of a tail armor. Yeah, and we lost our cover. That's bad. Pushing down the Legionnaire further. Let's still try to get down this adder. Nice little hit. Uh, you know what, we're going to use our own shield. Could take out uh, the adder. Where is number two? That's this legionnaire, okay. Yeah, that's the better move. It just deals more damage, so... This here might be a smash, but I don't want to use our team up ability yet. And we wouldn't be able to fully kill him. There is the smash. It's just a pretty painful hit. It 
standing in the open is not a good idea. No, both of them could select. We can't afford that. So, as much as it sucks, we're just healing and moving back. That's gonna hit the shield. Yeah, we're gonna be fine. Good. Let's use Battle Madness just to deal some more damage. Nice little crit into the le Legionary. I like it. And that knocks out the Viper plus deals damage to the Legionnaire. Still half cover, just in case you're wondering. Pushing them further back. That is suboptimal. I was hoping that we could take him out. Cheer up. Yes, again, kinetic shielding himself, and I think we can kill both of them here. Yep, and we're even in cover. Pinning this guy further down. Just want him to not act at the moment. Stun for an entire round, that's perfect. And take out the other one, that's even better. Good. I would like to put him in the middle here. And we're just pushing him further back. With our shields, we're making sure that even if he takes a turn, nothing is going to happen. Um, preparation done. Reducing profile. Healing right cheer up, and terminal needs to heal herself afterwards. Nice but we're on the right track. I set him up. You knock him down. Relocating him further, he's <laughs> always going further down the drain. Weapon ready. The 
this time Shelter gets the shield. And now he can actually take his action. Oh no, he's stunned. Well, that is unfortunate. Good. So we're overwatching. Let's heal ourselves. We're almost there, guys. And we're putting one final shield on our group. Now everyone's shielded. No matter what he's doing, he cannot injure us. Oh, and you know what? <laughs> okay, that even counts as a movement. Hilarious. I don't think Grey Phoenix came here for artifacts. They want what's on the secure servers. If they transmit what's on those servers, they'll have a map to every Illyrium stockpile in the city. Send me to that transmitter. I'll keep him away. Okay, so we can either go in all non-aggressive enemies guarding are surprised. Last one deals plus three damage. Um, you know what? We're actually going through the main door. The three damage looks nice on paper, but you're also sacrificing an entire unit um, that could take a shot. Reaching in. We're only looking at one enemy, and that's the Aider, which we can, in my opinion, pretty easily just kill. There we go, no more aggressors. That's the target. Stop them from approaching. Good, well then. Let's make sure Virch has a kinetic shield. Let's furthermore make sure Virch connect right after us. And let's use our flanking ability. Nope. Locking down. My mind over yours. All right, got her down. Well, you know, we could just tell this Legionnaire to shoot his friend. How about that? Or the other Viper. I'm fine with that as well. Yep, that's a good outcome. Acceptable. Why isn't he taking his overwatch shot, by the way? Yeah. 
Good. Pinning down the Legionnaire. So he cannot act right now. And I'd like to take the 50-50 to kill the Viper. Yep, that worked like a charm. Finally the Overwatch triggers. Gotta deal with this guy, by the way. But I do have an idea how we could do that. Relocating him out of here. But we can't continue to stay here, that's too dangerous. So probably... I mean, we could go over here and just hit someone with a subdue. Just like that, for instance. Yeah, I think that's even better. We do have enough time before this guy has his turn. And we're being bound. Wonderful. All right, kinetic shield over here. And let's see whom we can take. Can't see the python, that is, that is unfortunate. Can't see the guy in the executive room in here. That's also unfortunate. Oh, and we can't really charge anywhere either. Yeah, let's take this shot here. Didn't really work out. I'm wondering why we couldn't just move straight. Moving over here, we definitely need to deal with a python. Give me your mind. Originally, I wanted him to mind flay, so that's why I did not attack this legionary. Now, in hindsight, that was not a clever idea. But what we could do is we can give Verge another turn. Setting up the next Legionnaire. I move. This guy might uh, run Rampage and do a slam attack, but we got our shield. Nope, he instead... simply wants to transmit. Relocating and pushing him further down. And this should kill him. 
Good. No enemies transmitting. Unfortunately, we're bound again. Um, time for us to lock these guys down. Very nice. Shelter gets another healing. And we are overwatching just in case someone's moving into the zone. Not sure why that didn't trigger overwatch. Probably because the first move into overwatch is free. Like the first tile that you're moving into seems to be free. Shelter's doing really a nice job of uh, clearing uh, clearing out the target zone. My mind Yep, kinetic shield, gotcha. Good. I think we're just knocking him unconscious. Don't see a reason why we wouldn't. There we go, mostly lightly wounded, and oh yeah, we got 15, well that's plenty of captured enemies. <clears throat> Minus 2 uh, unrest, 40 credits and 20 intel. Grey Phoenix is after large quantities of Illyrium. Why do they need that much power? Illyrium access would allow them to refine an explosive powerful enough to kill Mayor Nightingale. Grey Phoenix has the means. Find out if they had the motive. Good. Grey Phoenix is definitely our prospect have number one. The growing amount of violence in our city? I have, Gorgo, I have. Makes me wonder if 31 PD knows how to do its job. That's a bold statement, Roger. All I'm saying is that it didn't used to be this way. Not when Shrike was keeping the peace. Oh, come on. Mercenaries make bad police. Everyone knows that. Maybe you're right, but at least there was peace. So we don't want to go with the standard missions. We're trying the delay tactic now, uh, which means we're freezing. As experienced, Grey Phoenix is surprisingly coordinated and disciplined. Discover what keeps them bound together. So this one here is frozen. And now it's just a matter of which one do we like better. 
epic submachine gun. Uh, yeah, we like that one better. Unless here are two epic guns. <laughs> epic shotgun. I can't believe it. Okay, yeah, we're going to go with the epic uh, submachine gun. Um, you can use, uh, buy that on the black market, but I never bothered in this playthrough to free up the black market. We needed the intel to actually build up the entire city, and we're pretty far in the build-up, by the way. Um, so it's going to be this mission here. Would be lovely to upgrade it, but we can't uh, even upgrade it to rank two. Yeah, we, we need to first of all research field teams rank three. And we're going to do that next, probably. It's a good upgrade. As for the rest, I think we haven't really... We haven't really um, had any other uh, decisions that we need to do. Everyone's pretty much stocked. Our teams are ready. And we're saving credits to get enhanced SMGs and enhanced um, auto rifles. Assault rifles, rather. Okay. Well, that brings us to the end of today's mission. Thank you so much for watching, guys. Uh, consider leaving a like and a comment down below. And see you in the next run. Bye-bye.